Hi guys, it's me Keith again. This time it's more of like a tutorial vlog. So I'm going to teach you on how you're going to install or not necessarily install but do the auto-tune effect on your audio mixes, your rap songs or even on your videos. Okay, so let's start. So the first thing that you need to do, be sure that you have this software with you on your Windows. Vegas Pro 17. You can download it by just googling it on of course in your Google Chrome browser and you can make a trial version for it first then once you like it then definitely you can just download the full version and of course buy it. So next is I'm going to pull out Chrome okay. then I'm going to search for a particular plugin. The name of the plugin is G-Snap. That's it. So the first link that will come out is the link that you're going to use. Tap on that one or click on that one. So while I'm going to download this, I'm going to use the 64-bit version for this. So for newer versions of PC, you can use this one. Uh, 2016 onwards, you can use this one, okay? So, click on that one and download it. Actually, I've already downloaded it, so I don't need to download it anymore. So I'm going to open my Vegas Pro 17 to uh, do some sort of configurations for this. It's kind of technical in some way. However, uh, it's pretty much easy to uh, figure out. Okay, so I'm just going to open it. I'm going to pull out the file that I have downloaded. It's somewhere in here. This one is G-Snap. Okay. All I need to do right now is just to extract the file, extract here. Now once you have extracted it, you will be able to see something like this, gsnap.dll, or the icon looks like something like this. Okay, so you can just copy it, click on copy, then go to your local disk C, go to program files, then look for the folder named VST Plugins. This is where you're going to place it. Actually, I already placed, I placed it uh, beforehand, so you don't need to. I don't need to do it anymore. So just place it in there. Then open your Vegas. Once it's already opened, uh, this is the environment of Vegas. If you're not familiar with it, click on Options. Then go to Preferences. So under preferences, go to VST effects. Okay, then just click on refresh so that the newly copied plugin will be visible somewhere in here. So it might take a couple of seconds for it to be loaded up. So let me check over there. G Snap is already there. Click on apply, click on OK. Now let's try if it works. So I'm going to record my voice using this recorder right here. So just click. Oh, I'm just going to save it somewhere. Oh, in there would be good. Hi guys, this is Keith. Uh, this is just a trial version. I'm going to check if my voice will have some sort of an auto-tune effect. Okay, so let's start. Then done. So this is the file. All I need to do is just to click on effects, then go to G Snap, add, OK. Now this is how it's going to look like. The next thing that you need to click on the preset here, then choose share the pane. After choosing share the pane, go to select a scale, then tick on this one, go to G Sharp. Uh, if you're going to ask me why I use G Sharp, well, I, I also don't know. Just do it. Okay, then choose this one, the Phrygian, something like Phrygian, or how do you pronounce it? I don't know. Click on OK. Now, once you're done with it, if you're going to try listening to this one, uh, it would be pretty much better if you have some sort of an earphone in listening to this so that you will be able to see the or hear the full effects. Let's go. Hi guys, this is Keith. Uh, this is just the trial version. I'm going to check if my voice will have some sort of an auto-tune effect. Okay, so let's start. 
seat so as you can see my normal voice is different and the autotune voice is different so that is how you're going to do the autotune effect in Vegas Pro now if you are not using your PC and you're using just your Android phone well it's not a problem actually guys so all you need to do is just to type in Vocolo okay I think Vocolo is the name Voloco sorry it's Voloco it's an autotune app so you can download it using your Android um, phones install it in your PC then follow the instructions then that's it you're done so I'm just giving you two different options you can use your PC you can use your phone so that's it guys so if you want other tips and tricks in mixing or even video editing audio editing as well as IT stuff you can just do the subscription and uh, do the request and I'll be giving it to you guys okay so bye for now